you've had a lot of threats, and you actually told me some of the threats, calling you certain kind of names, I think. Yeah. And you just talk about this sure. long saga of you getting threats, and you seem to yeah. still be sitting here. Yeah, I, I, I've gotten, you know, dozens of death threats over the years and, uh, you know, been called almost every imaginable name you can, you, can, you can imagine. At least they're almost everyone I can imagine. For me personally, why, you know, I persisted, I guess you could say. It's, it's the, the bridge you cross as a reporter uh, or any job where you have to kind of make that decision. Is it worth it? And to right. me, it's always worth it. I mean, and I always equated, and maybe it says something about my own mentality, you know, but I always kind of take everything back to the playground, you know. And, uh, but to me, these guys, you know, I was always like the shrimpy guy on the playground. I always got the crap beaten out of them, you know. That was me. And, um, but I've always think of these guys that are threatening as kind of like those guys, the bullies on the playground. And so... I, I've never responded well to bullies. I just don't, you know, they're trying to intimidate me, they're trying to frighten me, they're trying to scare me. It's like, yeah, I get in the line. <laughs>